June 28th, 1969, police raid the Stonewall Inn, a gay nightclub in the Greenwich Village neighborhood of Manhattan, New York. This was the beginning of the Stonewall riots. It all started with the police storming in, as they normally do, and arresting anyone they saw in the club. Usually the people arrested went reluctantly, but this time they protested their arrest. This led to the start of the Stonewall Uprising, or more commonly known as the Stonewall Riots. Stonewall veterans have strongly stated that they prefer the term Stonewall Uprising or Rebellion. Classifying these events as riots were initially used by police to justify their use of force. Police didn't expect the bargoers to get so violent, so they called for backup and barricaded themselves in the bar. Their barricade was easily breached and the bar was set on fire. No one got hurt from the fire since the police and firefighters got there just in time, but the rebellion continued throughout the streets for the next five days. It was not the first protest by gay groups, but it was the first time everyone united to fight together against police brutality. After the riots ended on July 3rd, 1969, it seemed that this injustice had finally come to an end. In fact, not long after, many positives started to emerge, such as many gay liberation groups, one popular one being the GLF, the Gay Liberation Front. Throughout its short time of protest, the riots still proved to have a significant impact on the LGBTQ plus community. Just compare how society treats LGBTQ plus members now to before the riots began. There's a noticeable change in what they were and weren't allowed to do, such things being able to have same-sex marriages and being open about expressing one's sexuality and oneself. The Stonewall Riots was and is a critical turning point and milestone for not just those of the LGBTQ+, but also those who aren't, as they can learn and understand the difficult challenges many went through to achieve something that was a basic human right. And even though the protests didn't last long, in their short time, they were able to influence society to this day significantly. This movement is not something that should simply be overlooked, so we must honor its legacy and carry the stories of those who lived through those unjust times, so the tales of Stonewall will never be forgotten.